so hi everyone welcome back to data science in a pocket and a new model cling oven the first unified multi-model video model is released it is a unified ai platform for image and video creation built for team collaboration secure training and enterprise scale workflows from concept to final cut what does it do it can do many things input anything that's the most exciting part Upload reference images up to seven or a video or simply start with a text idea, whatever you wish to do. Write the prompt. Use natural language to direct the scene and describe desired scenarios. Receive high fidelity videos in seconds. Iterate and edit the results seamlessly to perfect your shot. Let's see a few examples. Relight an atmosphere. You can see the lighting for this image is changing reframe and composition modify camera angles transform a wide shot into a close-up or change the lens type with a text prompt as you can see the camera angle is changing every time precise object swap instead of the fan now other things are also coming up you can do it easily smart cleanup remove unwanted objects and do whatever you wish to do with your video Extend and keyframing, extend shots spatially or instant swap backgrounds to a green screen. Recolor and restyle. Instantly shift color grades, change item colors or apply artistic styles, what and not. Unified multi-model engine. Unified video model, conversational editing and character consistency. Precise control tools. Start and end frame logic. As you can see, you can provide a start frame and an end frame. And you would be able to generate a video out of that. Mimic camera movement. Have video the perfect camera pan or character motion. Cling Oven can extract and apply that motion to a new character also. Control the pace. Control the timeline. Customize your generation length between 3 to 10 seconds to match the exact pacing. You can do a lot of things now. So without wasting a bit, we would be not testing out the mode video. So let's get started. So here we got Kling O1 as you can see on my screen. Let's first of all try out the start frame and end frame thing. Upload an image. Let's take a horse. And in the second image, we will take a ball. The horse playing with the ball and eventually the ball lands in the goal. I'm not sure what will generate. Let's see. We'll be testing on other features also, so don't worry about it. Now, here is the video generated. As you can see, let's run it. Very interesting. If you notice, the video started off with the horse and stopped on the ball. Looks interesting because it was a tricky prompt to use because the starting was a horse and the end was a ball pretty good let's try out something else this was draw to video sketch to video it is an entire engine as you can see let me upload elements now so we will upload multiple animals and let's see what it generates here you can see that the video is generated and it looks decent what i was mentioning it's not a continuous video, but I think given the prompt, this is okay, I would say. And I think it has missed out on the dog part. So I think dog and cat has been mixed. An okay video, I would say. Now let's jump on to the edit part. Create your videos. Try out the edit mode here. This is very interesting. Upload a video to edit. Upload image and elements. Up to four image and elements. Let me add... Uh, Video. This is a video with a sunflower. A guy is plucking a sunflower. Upload. Upload an image. So what shall we upload? Let me upload this ball. Now let me add a prompt. Replace the flower with the ball in the video. Now this is the most interesting section of Kling O1. Let's test it out. Generate video. This consumes more credits as you can see, 27. And it has went into queue for us. As you can see, the output is here. And let me test it out. It's very interesting because instead of the flower, now there is a ball. 
and leaves are coming out of it i didn't ignore that but i think the quality of the output looks just amazing it's nine second video it is able to generate and the output is amazing it is able to correctly replace the flower present in with the ball and not just that the cling team has also released cling oven prompt bank on hicks field that you can see there are certain golden rules of cling prompting that you should know to get the best outputs first of all is a multi-reference editing look at this output you will be just mesmerized adding multiple people as you can see changing the background seats changing colors and whatnot character referencing add people on you can see the samples output prompt here and what it can generate for you and it can change the styling also of the characters this is very interesting model that has come and here you can check out the prompts too background atmosphere change as you can see now it has become a shake now in jungle I, this is the best model I can see. It's crazingly good and I think we are in for a treat now. Background replacement is there. And the old father is running the bullock card. There are multiple examples that the team has given. Style changing. You just need to take your video and provide an image as we saw in the previous examples. And you can change the style of the entire video. This is quite cool I would say. Clean up. You can clean up subject removal also. You remove the entire audience. This is very exciting. Conclusion Cling O1 is more than just a generator. It's a creative partner. By mastering these 10 prompt structures that they have given, I can share the link in the comment section. You can try it out. This is available on Hicks Field. There are multiple other features on Hicks Field that you can try out the image generation, video generation, video editing, character, Sora 2 trends, and whatnot. Stay tuned and check out other new models that are coming on Hicks Field. Thank you so much. I hope you have a great day.